Queen Heartbreak as the only three people she ever trusted are now dead, claims biographer. The Queen is said to only have had three close confidants during her 95 years, according to royal author Matthew Dennison. He said Her Majesty was closer to the trio than any of her children or friends and now they are have all died. The expert said the Queen is more alone than ever before. Mr. Dennison said the trusted group included just her mother, her sister Princess Margaret and her husband Prince Philip. Writing in his new book, The Queen, the biographer said, in her long role as monarch, the Queen has probably trusted fully just three people, her mother, her sister and her husband, a trio to whom she was closer than any of her children or friends. After the deaths of the Queen Mother and Princess Margaret in 2002, Philip was the sole remaining member of that group. With his loss, the monarch is arguably more alone than at any time in her long life. But Mr. Dennison said the Queen was well prepared for the loss of her husband this year. He said, decades of building her personal strength and resilience through a complete understanding of the isolation at the heart of the role of monarch has, as I will reveal, prepared her for precisely such a time. The Queen was hit with a double loss in 2002 when both her mother and her sister passed away. Princess Margaret died on February 9, aged 71, having suffered a stroke. Her children, Lord Linley and Lady Sarah were by her side. Less than two months later, Buckingham Palace announced the sad news that the Queen Mother died peacefully in her sleep. The royal was 101 when she passed away, on March 30. She had been suffering with a bad cough and a chest infection. Prince Philip remained by her side throughout these two sad events, having been described as her rock. But sadly the Queen's husband passed away last month, having not long been discharged from hospital. Princess Eugenie, the couple's granddaughter, previously described the Queen and Prince Philip as each other's rock. She told Sky News ahead of the Queen's Dominant Jubilee. They are the most incredibly supportive couple to each other. Grandpa was unfortunately taken ill and for Granny to come and do that alone was probably quite testing and I think he is her rock, really, and she is his. Philip was unable to attend the celebrations as he was in hospital with a bladder infection.